Hello everyone and welcome back to another Transom World 2 video. We are on the rapid transit route and we're going to be going through the patch notes for, well, the most recent update which did come out about, uh, that was Tuesday, so about five days ago. Uh, so we're a little bit late, but I thought we'd yeah, do a little video on rapid transit and, well, tell you what's new. Um, and also what's been fixed, which most notably for any PZB users, PZB has now been fixed as before i think it was stuck on pzb mode where it's, where it's 55 which is heavy freight so a little bit odd um let's get the train set up and then we'll go through what is new uh let's do that uh also and also you might notice i shall show you in a second which is also very nice hopefully it is showing already ready no not there <laughs> not there you might have already got a little sneak peek of it there we go PIS, PIS on the on the old talent too. It is now here. Also, were these maps here before? They probably were, but I don't remember seeing these before. Um, but yeah, you've now got PIS on it. What about on the outside? Is it the scrolly one? I don't know. It's just the um, one which stays there. They go Leipzig, Stotteritz, S1. Very nice to see uh, on this route. Obviously, we've also got it on Colnarken and. Reza Dresden on the talent too, so good now to have it on here. Let's get the um, systems on. Uh, where are they? It's been a while. Uh, they're back here, aren't they? PZB, CIFA, and PZB. But yeah, you can see PZB is now fixed as well. Is the cab light on? Let me get that off. Okay, I think it's just the glare of the light behind us. But yeah, PZB has now been fixed, and there's the cat there trying to get on screen. So let's see uh, what has been sorted within this patch you might see my face go completely white so uh preservation crew rapid transit route operation so this is for oh hold on always always forget to release the parking brake now we should now be able to go come on let's go um i think we're all good to go we have locked everything there's the cat going over come on oh she's on the keyboard she's pressed things again I can't remember how you bloody make this thing go. Um, when we do that, I should be able to get going. That sounds good. No? Um, well, this is a bit funny. Oh, we should be able to go. Press buttons and hope something works. Um, well, with the master keys on, if I do that maybe. Um, Parking brake is off, or handbrake, I should say. So we should there should be no reason why we're stopped here. We should be able to get going. Give me a second, everyone. I shall have a look. Okay, yes, it was something very obvious. I so literally that literally as soon as I ended the recording, I was like, ah, oh, yes, I see what it is. The um, circuit breaker was not set to close. There we go. Now we're off. <laughs> As soon as I clicked end record in there, just have a little look. I, I saw the bar and I was like, oh yes, that's probably why. Uh, off we go. There you go. Because on the other ones, it's already up, so already set to closed. Off we go. But yeah, let's go through what has been changed on the routes. Yeah, route operations changed light rain to full raining for the metropolitan scenario. Um, art cars should no longer clip on road corners, uh, locos and rolling stock. So changed PZB to 85O uh, in default startup. Deleted rogue first class door, which was causing players to be blocked. Um, I'm, just, I'm keeping an eye on the route as well. Uh, updated seating. Recentered throttle to zero for rail driver. Um, updated screens to show correct time of day. Because I think the middle one was showing a slightly different time of day, which was quite weird. Um softened reflections on the windows added functionality for parking brake lighting which you can see just there it's all now lit up and it's come to a stop uh, also increased interior lighting of passenger compartments come to a stop there we go and then for the dbbl 182 which is a very good locomotive for this route Updated livery designer name to improve player experience. Replaced old AFB system with updated AFB system. That'll be interesting to see that on the 182, which I'm sure I'll stream at some point. Updated doors, no opening and closing on the doppel stock. 
and then now all for the double stocks. Updated livery designer name to improve player experience. Updated wipers to start on park rather than off. Uh, updated with a new PIS system and updated sounds to now be audible on the stairs. Uh, and then also added simple radio for contact signaler and updated rail driver map button mapping. So yeah, just rail driver fixes and you can now contact the signaler. Boom, there you go, using that, which is very nice. And yeah, added uh, functioning PIS displays to the Talent 2. Let's get going. Leipzig, Wilhelm Lucener Platz next. Uh, rush hour passenger be uh, passenger behaviours added, as well as a rush hour passenger volumes added. And there's also a new Dovetail Life Mastery reward, which is a landing cargo plane, which will be very cool to see. I don't know if anyone's unlocked that already. Feel free to post it in the Discord server. What does that look like? That must be quite cool to see. Yeah, landing cargo. But yeah, that is the um, changes to rapid transit. So not as substantial as the previous update for this, which did come out in October, which sort of added PIS, did level crossings, you know, the sort of majority, the big uh, preservation crew update, but a slightly smaller one, just getting things fixed and up to standards. So good to see that. Here we are, Wha max break on there, I was about to say wax break on there. Here we are, this is uh, my least favourite city tunnel station, the one which is all, well, lit up and, I don't know, what is your favourite underground station on here? Leipzig Stotteritz, which I, I believe we've actually been to, Stotteritz I think is this way. Because um, on Train Simulator, you've got the Barnstrecker Dresden to Leipzig now. So it goes on past Riesa. Um So this track here then connects up with um, this one here. They sort of connect up like around there. And that's where the... Um, I think that's where the S1 goes. Or one of them. Leipzig Bayerischer next. Off we go. Let's go full whack. And we're due there now, so we're already late. Oh well. So we've got Bayerischer and then MDR, which I'm pretty sure MDR is actually a radio station, Middle Deutschland Radio or something like that. I remember someone, because I was just like, why is it called Leipzig MDR? What does MDR mean? And someone was like, oh, there's a radio station called MDR, like right next to the station or something like that. I might be wrong there, so just comment below. See you fat. We going a little bit quick. Does the city tunnel look better as well? Don't know. Seems like it feels better. I suppose this would sort of be um, similar to say if we ever got the Elizabeth line in the game, uh, which I highly doubt it, as it's ATO, isn't it, through the centre? Um, I suppose it would sort of be fairly similar. You know, a full sort of overground, same similar type of train ish. But yeah, this is the rapid transit route, the Leipzig S-Bahn from Mackleburg Gashwich, I think it is, to Dessau. So quite a long route, it's actually really long, it takes about an hour and a half if you're doing a slow service from one end to the other. And you get the city tunnel section, a high speed section, well, 100 miles an hour. Um, so it's, it's very good. Should really have it just on that, there we go. I do like to see, yeah, it's good to see the um, PIS on the front. And can you change it as well? Or is it by it? Just, yeah, you can't. Oh, you can, there we go. That's a really long name there. Let's put the really long name one on. That's a really, look at that one. Let's see what that one looks like on the front. Oh, wow. <laughs> look at that. We'll trick passengers. They think we'll go in there now. Leipzig MDR next, let's get going. You can scroll through them. It's a bit weird the way they don't show up. Uh, we're going to stutter it, aren't we? There we go. Off we go, it's MDR next. But yeah, it's nice to see PIS on here. A route which was in need of um, another upgrade, and well, now it's got it. I mean, this route now is in line with other TSW2 routes, PIS, level crossings, on the trains as well as the PIS. Um, See, so yeah, it's near enough in line with other routes now. 
And I think the render distance was changed as well to see make it better. Or has it? Maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. I can still see it sort of loading in as we go along. But compared to what it used to be, it's yeah, it's it's much better. So it's had two preservation crew updates now. So quite a bit of work has gone into uh, into this one. And this is Leipzig MDR, which we want to bring the speed down before it gets angry at us. Brakes on here are brilliant. But yeah, we'll leave a link below if you do want to check the patch notes out yourself. So you've got the ones from Habstrecker, Ryan Roo and Resealed Nordland there, so we actually have done a stream of. So feel free to check that one out if you do want to see the changes to that. It's not a bad route though, Rapid Transit. This is actually the oldest German route in the game, believe it or not. Yeah, the oldest one. So yeah, the first one we got was a Middle Deutschland one. Which is still DB, it's just a different, I suppose, sub-brand of DB, or just a certain different livery. A bit like the Berlin trains, I think they have like the old, like an old classic livery. So it's sort of similar for... For this one but in Leipzig but yeah hopefully everyone has enjoyed that that was uh, yeah look at the rapid transit update which I think has been brilliant and at some point I'll do a stream and we'll show off the 182 and the Dostos um, separately but yeah hopefully everyone has enjoyed it links can be found in the description to the discord server to the paypal and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel apart from that thanks all for coming in and hopefully we'll see you next time see you all take care bye guys Thank you.